Hotel surveillance giving police a very clear picture of what happened inside Trump National Doral back in May, moments before a man went on a shooting spree with police officers. Police say the footage shows 42-year-old Jonathan Odie dressed in all black, walking through the hotel lobby holding a gun, forcing employees to run away. In the video, you see Odie leave, then return moments later, clearly unhappy and dragging a huge American flag shooting into the ceiling. He proceeds to drape the counter with the flag, angrily walking around, knocking stuff over, and even at one point trying to take down the surveillance camera. Once the flag is over the counter, Odie stands back and seems to yell before going back to destroying the computers covered by the flag. Moments later, it was hands up for Odie as police arrive. Watch as he starts ducking, even looks like he's about to surrender while police fire shots into the hotel, but he takes his gun and fires back. The gun battle goes on for nearly a minute before Odie decides to make a run for it. Another camera capturing him still firing shots, even tripping on the marble floor. Odie was shot in the legs as he ran away and was arrested after running up a stairwell. Shortly after this unfolded, police released body camera footage of the shootout, even showing the moments police went into the hotel, closing in on the suspect. Well, luckily, no police officer was hit by the gunfire. Odie suffered minor injuries from his gunshots to the leg. He remains behind bars. His defense attorney says he suffers a mental, suffered a mental breakdown and is sorry for the violent outburst.